Hi, this video we're going to show you about our 4K AVP system with the KVM workstation. So here we have the setup. Basically, right now we can see we have like the uh, desktop and also mini PC. And on both PC we have the HDMI cable and also USB cable. This is the desktop, which we have it connect to the first transmitter. So on the first transmitter we have the HDMI input and the USB connect to the PC port and on the second transmitter we have it connect to the mini PC over here. Also the same USB port and the HDMI port are connected. So these two trans transmitters are using the PoE or the LAN cable which didn't use the DC pass by and other three four units are as the spare unit. And on the side is going to be our uh, receiver side, which is connected to the video. And we have like eight receivers are connected to the uh, video wall. Right now, we can see it's actually working as a two by four video wall. Right. And over here's the one gigabit now switch with the PoE function. And then we have a PoE have another line cable are connected to this. Uh, receiver here on this receiver we call it as the KVM receiver so for the KVM receiver basically we have the HDMI output connected to this monitor here and right now it's actually uh, showing as a night window multi-viewer and then we have the audio in and out and the USB port which is for the cable and mouse here so basically with one cable and mouse I can remotely control the two PCs over there and then the LAN cable which connect back to the next switch okay so now I'm just going to show like how we use this one cable mouse to manage the video wall and also to control the two PC remotely so basically with the cable and mouse thing we can just see we have the OS menu showing up on the top of the uh, monitor here then we have the First one is for the uh, source preview, right? We can click the button, then we can see we have like two sources connected. And pr the preview, this one is kind of like uh, to restore the layouts. Like right now we have a night window, but we also can choose like different layouts. We can simply press the uh, layout button here. Then we can see we have like different layouts. We can back to the like, this one is uh, for the core view, right? And also we have the, uh, a window preview which is with like one large and uh, we have uh, seven small window here and this one is going to be the uh, three by three and uh, as a, a nice screen multi viewer okay except these uh, layout but we also have like the cooperation cooperation is pretty much just for us to do like the uh, video wall country and also the centers like right now we have the source list and also we have the centers and okay so this is the video wall and we can share the source here we can just drag one of the source to the video wall and see how it works so now i'm just going to drag the source to the video wall right it's actually what is switching drag another source so this is one way for us to, to use the kvm workstation to do the switching on the video wall okay so another one is like uh, we have the uh, pull contents or push contents like pull contents is pretty much just like uh, firstly we need to select a window on the KVM station like right now we have this window selected right we just go back to the OS menu again then we can uh, call operation so now we can just pull the contents which means we can pull the video contents back to this window right now where they have it put here but also we can choose, we can just push these contents to the video wall. So firstly, we just select this window and go to the OS menu again. Then call operation. Then here we have the, uh, the spottings for the uh, push contents to the video wall. So now we're going to push the contents to the video wall now. Right, so we have this window is pushed out to the video wall behind. Okay, so this is how we uh, have the call operation. But Except this one, we also have like other functions like the uh, clear the video wall or the refresh or call the centers or we have it as a, a full window or we can have a divide, divide window. So the divide window and the full window don't difference you like, we can check it out. Once we have click the full window and we go to the source, now we can do is we can just drag the source, just go as a full screen on the video. Right? But if we just use like the uh, device screen, divide video wall and then it will be different 
So we just go to the divide video wall and now we can see we have like different uh, grid here and we can choose a source. Now we got the uh, one by two screen, but let's just make a two by two screen here, video wall here. So firstly, we also need to do, we need to select the source, then open the window here. Now we got a video wall here, two by two. This two screen, we're just going to have it showing independently. Right, so now we have like these two screens showing evenly, and this one is one by two. This is two by two. Okay, so this is the for the car operation. Except this one, we also have like the uh, intercom. Basically, it's uh, for the different KVM station. They can talk to each other, and then we also have like the settings, and basically for us to set out like the uh, country IP address, and then we can quit, then we can log in with like different username. With the admin login, basically you can control all the settings. Right? This is the settings, including like uh, we have the source management and the video management. Video management is basically for us to set up like the KVM station video. Such as right now, I only have like one screen, but if I have two screens, so basically I want to do is like the mouse roaming, so I can just set up as a one by two KVM station here. Except this one, we also got like the user management, so we can add like different users, such as I had at the Rocky as the user uh, permission, and also we can enter the system or exit the system, so we can just enter the system, and it will just as the uh, admin. Okay, so basically we also can have like the OSD menu here, and we go to the setting and. Uh, uh, quit. Basically, we can just quit back to the OS menu login again. On this one, we can do is we can set up like the source with the uh, hotkey switching. Like right now, we have like two sources, but I can set up with different uh, hotkey switching. So we can just end the system, see how the hotkey switching works. Right now, I have the country plus one, which is switched to this first PC, country plus two, switch to the second PC. Let's see how it works. Okay, so now I'm just going to enter the system and uh, I can just double click one of these screen, then I can do the controlling, right? Right, so how we do the countries. Okay, I can just type here, like welcome. Right, okay, and I can just use the hotkey for the switching country plus one, switching to the uh, first PC. Same thing, I can just say it's the uh, PC 3, 4, 5. Switching back to the uh, second PC. Right, this is the uh, KVM station. And if you want to back to the multi view, then we can just simply click the West menu again then restore, then we have it back to the multi-view with the nice screens, but we also can switch to like the core view. It's pretty much just the same thing, okay. So this is the, our uh, KVM station with the video control and multi-view on the KVM station. Also push or grab the contents from the video. Okay, thank you.